Hello. Um, I see the lip syncing is not working exactly as it should, but <laughs> oh well. Also, I did change it up back to already yesterday. I think it's very fitting for this game, but it's more so because I moved the image uh, of the original and yeah, I just chose random one to replace it. But yeah, hope everyone is good. I hope one day we will get rid of the lost donation chaos because yeah. That person's name is so bloody long bad it's yeah, it's 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 all over the place. But we we will fix that some other time. Um I haven't had my second coffee yet today, which compared to four years ago is so good in comparison. <laughs> I think it used to be like five to seven a day. I did have a fruit smoothie today, it was healthy. Not that I've done a workout or anything, but at least I've eaten something healthy. Have I eaten a lot otherwise? I think today the probably Let's have a decent breakfast, so don't come for me. <laughs> um, but yeah, partial, I don't know. But I i keep thinking about the game, so obviously I'm coming back to play some more Harmony. And I'm kind of also excited to go into Jusand and do the collaborative stream with my friend Anna that I have planned. So uh, yeah, without further ado, I'm gonna go and solve the game and we'll see how many acts we can get through today. Um, but yeah, there will definitely be need for a coffee break. <laughs> we'll switch into gaming. And thankfully, thanks to Nezu, we know that the audio is fine. Or rather that I switched off um, the other audio. Let me just move this. Where? Good. Good, good, good. Hey, Anna! <laughs> Nezu was here yesterday when I was playing this, so uh, the first part of it is somewhere, but it's really fucking cool. Um, so it's again a Choices Matter. It's again by Don't Nut, um, because we, we, we love Don't Nut. And yeah, so we have actually a grown woman who is a person of color, which is fucking A. Um, she came back to Atina, which seemed to be an island in the Mediterranean, but closer to the Balkans. Um, and there is a concern. <laughs> I can't help it. They write it. It is written uh, like the German word, so I'm, I'm also pronouncing it like it's mono concern. And they've kind of taken over this, the, this, this whole island, which is also the capital. Um, and uh, there's a lot of surveillance stuff. There's a lot of drones and stuff going on. And we just have met up with an activist. Uh, because her mother has disappeared and um, she has teamed up with a good friend of hers and her grandfather who are both broke and all the the friend almost considered working for the concern but we kind of got her to drop that idea and we've talked to this activist who's trying to take this concern down and has been doing research and kind of has like a target on her back because she had been working together with the mother to do like a new article a new news story about it um, on top of that, so the mom and and I think all of them, well at least her and her friend and lots of other people, they used to live in an artist commune and it is kind of in like an old swimming pool kind of building and it's super fucking cool. We also immediately spotted a trans flag, which is a massive plus. Um, most of the characters, the, the activist is, is a black woman. Um, overall seems pretty cool, but I'm, I'm very happy to see like a middle aged woman to be being the protagonist um but yeah so basically we're trying to find the mom but she in uh, the bedroom of her mom found a necklace and the necklace kind of transports her to the other side of the coin because our world is referred to as brittle and then on the other side you have the reverie so obviously it's linking to dreams um and there we met bliss who is like a really super asian coded cute nerdy character then you have Power, um, who is the older male presenting, very big character. Um, we just glued truth together. Oh, and there's Bond, who is um, actually, interestingly, it, it, to me, it feels like it's a bit Indian, but black mix coded because he lives in mangroves and he's kind of dressed like somebody who would be part of either a Hinduistic or Buddhist uh, religion, and he represents Bond. So we have Bliss, Power, Bond, and now also Truth, and you collect crystals based on your choices, and based on the choice of how many crystals of whichever one you have, um, that affects the choices you can make. So that's a pretty quick rundown. So yeah, there is an outcome because I collected enough Bliss crystals, 
because here you would have needed bond and power. Um, so we're gonna see what this. Uh, no, this is I actually know this one. <sighs> There's a bit too many tutorials for my liking. I think this is us going back to truth again. Yeah. Yep. 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 So we're going to truth temple because this was the end of this chapter. So you get to see that again. I mean, yeah, I do the face. Take your time. Where are we? So that is our main protagonist, who is called Harmony uh, in, in the Reverie. And the swimming pool area where she lived, and adjacent to it, I think she had a workshop, those, that's the name they yes. I mean, we have a whole code expert, lost some of breath from it. It was a bit spoilery, it's a little chicken. Trist domain. Figured out a way inside. Finally. Yeah, they all were working anyway, the Anyway, shall we? She is adorable. I'm assuming she could also be that. I'm surprised to find a cave called Dam. Not at all where I imagined the aspiration of truth would reside. Empty walls, clear water, no filthy void. I read all of this yesterday. It could be how I picture facts and accuracy. <sighs> Chilly in here, innit? This whistles to herself despite the down surroundings. I see true vent center there broken and shattered, where I was like, oh, do we have some glow? I move closer with footsteps echoing in the void or dying entirely. Even right then. Let's get this old witch back in shape, shall we? The diminutive aspiration digs through her pockets, extracting a multitude of objects. A garlic press, a halberd, a small owl like creature staring out from a cage. Where again, insert Mary Poppins joke. I know it's in here somewhere. Aha! She brandishes a colossal tube of blue the size of a bazooka. Reference to Jinx yesterday. Um, also, they can interact in the normal world as well, but only we can see them, obviously. But people would notice if we talk to them. Um, they would talk to ourselves. Not surprisingly, it's an eyeball. Now then. Drink. She uncaps the tube. Somewhere is all of this is for show. A ritual tied to... This is nature. Yet something changes in the air. A vibration, a rhythm, a hum coming from the statue itself. And this is where Act 1 ended. Maze, there's a lot I need to figure out for myself. Yep. Oh, it skipped a trailer because this is new. Skeletons and skeletons. Silence reigns in the cave. Okay, it does come back every single time. The new figure stands before me, regarding me with cool eyes. I hope Bliss was right that I know where my mother is. The aspiration stirs. Bliss, bond, power, they're all here. I am truth. I am the eye that sees. The unveiled. The watcher in the dark. And I am whole. Once more. Thanks to you, Harmony. You're welcome, but please, my mother, Ursula Beauclair, do you know where she is? My memories remain out of reach, shattered like my cell. Although I cannot tell you where your mother may be, I do know her fate is entwined with that of chaos. And that it was chaos who... Incapacitated me. This is such a 
going around with this weird noise by something. Bond seems to be uncomfortable, but power stands and begins pacing, almost blood. This is outrageous! We have tolerated this charlatan's exploits for far too long. I told you before, chaos would be the death of us. Always scheming and plotting against their own kin. Uh -huh. They may have a maze, but I have an army. I'll flush him out in no time. Oh, is it still that lot? <laughs> well, maybe it reset. Because um, yesterday it was... Oh, I'll, I'll move the microphone because whenever somebody's in the... In yeah, doing something with my desk. Ugh, it gets moved an awful lot. Um, and then again, I do occasionally switch things up because of DMT. Uh, but I'm also just gonna bring that lower. Is it any better now? Because we already had issues with that yesterday. Because I knew the music was super loud. I don't like the sound of that at all. Also, I mean. An army against a maze? Come on, that's not gonna no. work. Such violence would only widen the rift that already threatens to tear Reverie apart. Right? Oh, wait, I know what it is. There we go. Oh, it was spot on. Shit. I might have changed it now. <laughs> I'm putting it a tiny bit back. Okay. Yeah, because also it depends from game to game and sometimes because I'm messing with the settings of my overall game audio because sometimes, for example, Honkai Star Rail is incredibly loud. Um, that's what happens. We need to listen to each other, please. Yeah, this is... Harmony. Our and kin this chaos because... retreated to their endless maze shortly after truth disappeared. Now we know why. That maze? Is it impenetrable? I mean, it has to be a start and an end. It's point. a labyrinth of trickery and tomfoolery built by a coward. I'd go in there myself, only... Only we cannot enter an Aspiration's domain without being invited. Hmm. It does give labyrinth at the moment. And that charlatan will never let us in. They will refuse to fight face to face. Well, not everyone That's has to. enough. Chaos may be unbound, but the secret to their return is consensus, not division. <laughs> well, doesn't that make it sound like, oh, wait, what was that anime called? Um, that is all about game. Games. Games Live? I know it had something with life. It's a it's a pair of siblings who end up in a world where basically anyone and anything can constantly be challenged by games. Um, which has some absolutely fantastic um, episodes of conflict uh, being resolved with with games, and they were so incredibly clever. But the sister, being quite a bit younger, yeah, there was like a weird level of fan service in in a lolly kind of way that made me uncomfortable. Uh, but other than that, it was great. No game, no life. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> I remembered. It is very, very short because it's based on a light novel, but it is a great anime. Um, and it came out before Isekai was such a huge established genre. Bond is correct. War is an engine of strife and in direct opposition to our needs. We don't want to weaken the heart anymore than we are. Than they already and may I remind you, we have other matters to attend to. Our realm lies in tatters, a shadow of itself. Glory refuses reason at every turn. We must decide where our attention is most required. I need to remind them I have to find my mother for the sake of my own family. Did I speak too frankly? They seem. I. I hope you understand. They can also read her thoughts unless she blocks them out willingly. Certainly. It is the <clears> logical <throat> choice. Well, and it all seems interlinked anyway. But I would suggest that a search for chaos and a search for Ursula may well be one and the same. There we go. I don't understand. Why would they be linked? What aren't you telling me? Not a single one of them can look me in the eye. Another secret, another closed door, I need to pry open with my bare hands. I may have a mutually beneficial solution. May. 
As I say, my memory remains treacherous. Go home. Await the coming of tomorrow. And we will see if fate guides us true. Fate? <laughs> the loss is getting my throat. Fate hurts. is an easy word to throw around. I. I'll wait for tomorrow. I am pleased. The other respirations look set to launch into their own sales pitches. But I've made up my mind. I bid them farewell, close my eyes, and plunge back down the rabbit hole to the But yeah, see, this is why I need at least one person watching <laughs> so that I can be told off whether my microphone is too low or the game is too loud and likewise I'm back at the Nayas. This time we're looking the other way. <clears throat> Traveling between the two realms is always a brief and uneventful affair. Wait, I'm not alone. Just bless it. Something fogs my vision. A popping, crackling sensation that could only well, be... Well, that was a pretty mess, wasn't it? Exactly who I thought a chaos was. Chaos? I don't understand. Bond said you were hiding, so how are you here? Now? Hiding? <laughs> I'm not hiding. I'm out here relaxing. Taking a load off. Escaping the rat race. Oh, okay, I like the voice. You've seen the others. Can you blame me? Doesn't mean I can't talk to you, though, you lucky thing. <laughs> We're getting a tiny bit of hysteria, I think. But why? Why won't you work with them, then? Because they've got it all wrong, you see? I am chaos. As much as truth is truth and power is power. They aren't just names, my dear. I'm not hiding from you. I'm just in a place that requires effort to reach. Live your life by my name. I'm sure we'll see each other soon. Use energy, absolutely. <laughs> bye bye for now. And they're gone, taking their riddles with them. There's hardly that much of a riddle. Live your life by my name. They're offering me another path, right? <clears throat> Whatever's coming my way, I need a break. And we might need chaos to take down the concern. It's late. I'm tired and anxious about whatever truth is planned for tomorrow. Time to eke out whatever rest I can manage. Eat? Okay. Oh, this is new. A chosen number of crystals you've collected throughout the story. Yep. Aspirations need Agrabor to extend their influence over Brittle. While if it were up to me, I would want all of them to have equal chance. Collecting the crystal fills up the gauge that represents a need for Agrabor. You can press H to open the screen at any time. Filling a need, completing the world change at your destiny. Will you choose a champion? Well, I mean, for now, we're, we're very much going towards less. Will you try to maintain balance between the forces ruling both bravery and brittle? Hold on. Ruling both? And now I wonder who the other, the last person is. I mean, you've seen the design, I just don't know what they represent. But bliss is like, um, like childish bliss. That is basically how she was presented. I think being referred to with female pronouns. Um. But if you say that it's brittle and reverie, then I'm not sure I trust power. Oops. Me hitting escape every time. Look to. <clears throat> so this is where we are. I mean, yeah. Choosing your parts. A new day without leave. I need to talk with Nora and Laszlo. So Nora is the friend, Laszlo is her grandfather. It's been five years since it was last on Athena. It's weird to be back. So much has changed. So, so much is new. What's the plan? See, we're here. There, trans flag. Um, I haven't spotted anything else. Of, I, I, I do love this spray paint. I love that this drawings all over. But yeah, definitely spring cool. Hello, Carly. You showed up behind me. Miss Laszlo, Nora, and I are in the kitchen. A bit phased out and a bit lost. We're still half asleep. I just woke up, Grandpa. Grandpa, Nora's always called her grandfather that. Of course, Lusso's always hated the town. But it's the plan is to find some breakfast. <laughs> mm. You mean get me to make you some breakfast, hmm? Same if thing. you're offering. <laughs> They're smiling. But there's desperation in their eyes. We have no idea what Polly? to do. 
Got any more substantial, less food-oriented ideas, dear? I... I'm trying to figure out our next move. We don't know where Ursula is. Not a clue. We need a lead. I really love her character design and the voice. <sighs> we need a miracle. The entrance bell rings. A couple of short, decisive questions. You were saying? Could it be the aspirations? Could it be the hard truth mentioned before? Okay. So now you've got the outcome you chose at the end of the previous act. Too many operative consequences for now. Things are quite simple, but it might be different later. I know. Can I even go this way? I don't know. You could have been more open about Ursula's disappearance. I disagree. We have just lost the last fight. I, I, I think it's smarter to not go public. And I think we couldn't use the other one anyway. Before anyone else can move, I head over to the gate to see who it is. Lazaro and Nora follow in silence. See, this building is amazing. Oh, the terrace. We were at the skate park. I led Lazo's bar yesterday. I know, I'll start with the awning. Today I have a legitimate reason to yawn though, it's almost midnight. It's a man, a stranger, short footed, the shadow of a smile on his lips, a glimmer in his eyes. Uh oh. Is this someone from the concert? Good morning. Oh no. Oh, that thing. He's impressive. Attractive. I've seen that glimmer before. In university folk, professors, experts. Sparkle of expertise. Can we help you? I'm uh, looking for Ursula. Well, you and the rest of the world. We kept her disappearance a secret, but still, someone cares. Us too. Sorry, but we have no idea where she might be. That's concerning. He's so calm. I came here because she missed our last appointment. Um, who are you exactly? I own a bookshop on Liberation Road. Academic stuff, mainly. Well, that's in these days, right? nerd stuff. <laughs> I specialize in literature about the Oxion culture. Topic Ursula and I both study. Yeah, she's done a lot of research on that. And yeah, we have Russell Bar, the drones, the concern itself. Yeah, there's a cool we have the mayor the Shad wishes where she has stuff. Oh, okay, that means there's two others. I wouldn't be surprised if one of them ends up being her mother, to be honest. We had Tower Stronghold, which was a tower with a huge seat, and we only had troops, so we haven't been to any of the others. So, aspirations, they, um, oh, there was a really good thing about, like, because she asked, are you gods? And he was like, no, we're not gods, because gods can be killed. Um, and we are not. And yeah, that they have always been around. Uh, Supertless Our World, Agrigora said Energy, Harmony is the other version of us. I was caught. Uh... Oh yeah, his his court, yeah. We know about the maze. And the Nexus is, yeah, the center. So yeah, we had Jade, Roslo, Nora, and Polly, who is us. Still remember if we had the father's name, that's why I don't really one, two. Jesus. Okay. Okay, ah, uh, there we go. The Oxians, the culture that once stood on this land. So, native culture. Builders of temples, word melders, and poetic fishermen, like many cultures around the Mediterranean. Have they been linked to reverie, to whatever? Nobody in on? town had heard from her, so I closed up my shop and came here. This was her forwarding address for orders, you know? He looks around at the building from the gate. It's impressive, but definitely showing Not its age. Not surprising, I guess. This place used to be a haven for poets and artists. Free thinkers of all kinds. Commons rings harsh, but it's true. The Nayans isn't as important to Atina as it was 10 or 15 mm. years ago. She never mentioned you, Mr... Please, call me Omar. Omar. I'm Nora. Polly. That's Laszlo. I'm Ursula's daughter. I felt that might be the case. Why does he look so shocked? He smiles. Faintly. Enough for me to guess that the aspirations might be behind this. Truth led him here. Why didn't you come in? Hmm. Bold assumption? Okay, for now we're just going through a here. It's hard to focus.
breakfast. The four of us walk towards a building, none of us saying a word. The lawn is gorgeous. In the summer, the home community of Alma gathers here. Soup kitcheners often run out of the kitchen. Ursula cooks for the, but the, the sorry cooks for a battalion while Laszlo serves food and helps out along with anyone so, else who's around. First time here? That's a good question. Not everyone on the island has visited an AS as famous yeah. as it is. I moved to Atina a couple of years back. Did my masters on the Oxion civilization, so obviously I had to come here to finish it. Atina. Okay. When we hear it, we know. I smile. I did the exact opposite. Studied here until I could get as far away from Atina as How possible. did you end up living here? We've been here since... forever. Ursula used all of her money to keep this place afloat. Now it's just debts and leaky pipes. It is granddaughter's worst Laszlo nonce. That draws a smile from Omar. Good. The tension seems to be clearing. It's true behind Perhaps. Omar's visit. <laughs> The voice in my head feels like a swarm of bees rushing through my skull. Consider Oma here a helpful stranger, encountered on an unknown path. One who does not know the way, but is in possession of a map. Okay, so truth, definitely they, them. Chaos, also definitely they, them. I think we're just going to default to non-binary for all of them. A wave of gratitude emanates from the aspiration. Is this their way of thinking? Think of me? this as... A resetting of the balance. The stranger may be the key to finding my mother. Laszlo and Nora seem to realize this too. It looks like they're dying to interrogate her. So, what do you know about Ursula? Did you notice anything strange about her? Yeah, he's super freaked out and worried. Calm down, Grandpa. But did she say anything to you about leaving? About going away? Do you have any leads? Truth is still there. Behind I'd eyes. let them ask their questions before letting him into your sanctum. You can never tell with people. Not these days. But you sent him to us. More like he washed up on your shores. My eyes practically roll themselves. I feel the weight of power and bond arrive, and something else. A faint presence I'm not familiar Whatever with. they might say, truth is relieved as are we all yes thankful also you're welcome yes. but right now i've got a stranger to deal with the odd presence remains silent before fading entirely but i have more pressing matters to attend to it's got to be the last one i guess Homer's managed to appease nora and laszlo but i need to make sure we can trust him i mean yeah truth did give us a fair warning so yeah now we have the five um, it means that several nodes are available and you must place a certain number of them in order to progress on one team. You must choose two nodes among the three that are available. Okay. When was the last time he heard? Good. What was there between them? Is he her new lover? Not really relevant though. What does Atena's ancient civilization have to do with Ursula? Eh, I mean we know that. I'm definitely taking this one for now and then we'll see. As I get a better look at Omar, I can tell he's traveled a lot. It's the little things, mannerisms you don't find in people here. It feels like he's trying too hard, like his calm exterior is a facade. That might be what's pushing Lesko so, away. Ursula, how often did you two meet? She popped by the bookshop when she was in the area. Uh, every few days. And recently we'd met as friends. Social calls. Yeah, I guess he mentioned an appointment that you missed. Leslo stiffens, just a little. Yeah, because he used to have an image, a picture of her hung up at his bar, so I don't know if they also used to be lovers, but he seems very strongly emotionally. She pressed. never mentioned you. She talked about you all the time. I went to your bar once, and I was struck by um, how <laughs> similar you were to her description. Again, it's a compliment. Let's not get sidetracked. The last time you saw her was... A few weeks ago. She came by to borrow a book I'd recommended. Oxion Legacy and the Spiritualist Diaspora. She didn't hmm. seem out of sorts. I mean, considering we're all talking about Oxion, couldn't it be that I don't know what the remnants of that culture are, but if there are some, I don't know, caves, grottos or something that still have, like, depictions from it, uh, wouldn't that have been a place to look for her? Oh, 
I actually bought something that could be of help. A map with Volker? As Omar rummages through his pockets, I feel the unmistakable weight of Pound's presence. <clears throat> Whether Omar means to or not, he brings great upheaval. Uh oh. Well, that sounds like it's a lot of things. Right now, upheaval or no, he's all we've got. And I'm gonna have to make the other choice, of course. two shards of truth over here so if I want to go this way regardless then it doesn't matter as long as I take this one okay but between what was it between them is he her new lover it's not really relevant to her disappearance though I feel but this is also Ask about the oxen's query about their friendship, but on the other hand, yeah, we need to get to know him more because I think the oxen's is not helping as much. Oh god damn it. I don't know. I don't know. I think they're both rubbish. <laughs> mm. But people do seem on edge. I, I do think I have to step into this one and I'm losing the other thing. Just how well did he know my mother? So you and Ursula were friends? Oma looks momentarily taken aback. Yeah, because it's kind of, we already had signs for it. The gleam in his eyes dimming as he ponders the question. Yes. Yes, I suppose we were. We bonded over our love of the Oxion culture and... Yes. Friends. But I haven't known her that long. A few months, maybe. I mean, if it's most of benefits, who cares? I hear Laszlo cross his arms, a rustle of fabric, followed by a barely audible grunt. Nora senses the tension. Laszlo and Ursula have a pretty open relationship. So, why the attitude? Why the concern? Okay, so they were in a relationship, and it is open. Wow. Okay. I guess it's our lucky day. You might be just the person we've been looking for. Before I can agree, a peal of laughter rings across the courtyard. No one's smiling, but there's the laughter again. Quick and manic. Oh, chaos. Look <laughs> at him! For a man who prides himself on being pure-hearted, he's quite the bleeding heart. I try to ignore the fizzing sensation at the back of my mind. Also, I don't know which one of the two he's talking about. Oh, you're no fun. As swiftly as day appeared, the cloud of their presence retreats, their laughter echoing across the sea below. Okay, we have to go this way anyway. I can't believe she'd start writing again after all this time. Okay, we're getting this anyway. Hmm. I can't say I trust him, but he's our best lead so far. Laszlo and Nora's not are back in Omar inside. Did we really find out enough? Here, though? I found these. I think, I think they might provide a clue, or a lead, or, well, I'm not a detective, but they look relevant, at least. Mm -hmm. He passes me a few crumbled scraps Ursula's of paper. Ursula's handwriting. Yes. It's part of her latest work. She gave them to me a few weeks ago and claimed she had a notebook somewhere containing the rest. I... I think I can help you. I know exactly where it is. Wait here, all of you. Hmm. He almost pirouettes on his way out. Nora stifles a laugh despite the reasons behind the You're becoming meeting. our lucky charm. <laughs> well, I was just worried about Ursula. It's, um... Good to know I'm not alone. We'll get to the bottom of this. Now that we have a lead, there's no stopping us. I love Nora's enthusiasm. I can't help but smile at Nora's confidence, but before I can speak, Lazaro practically batters down the door on his way back. She told me where it was years ago. No secrets between us. Bless you for having to re-utter that. 
But I couldn't bring myself to open it and read it. it it's her personal stuff, you know? But now we do. Laszlo, adorable Laszlo. Even with Ursula missing, he still thought it would be wrong to read her notebook. Everybody looks at the damn thing. It's pretty, but opening it Perfect. feels like a betrayal. I know we might regret this later, but sometimes the unethical thing to do is the right one. Oh, this is the choice we get, right? He leaves through the notebook. Oh, thank God, he took that away from me. A sorry looking and surprisingly thin affair. A concerned it's look filled. darkens his face. Uh, cover to cover. Too much for one person to read. If I just... Ah, there. Excuse me? I could read that. Homer slowly unties the leather cord, binding the pages together. I've never heard Laszlo make that noise before. Kind of strangled... Uh, Nora, snot. was it? Here. Two sheets. Laszlo, take these three. I'll take these other three. And Polly, these are yours. Ha! Huh? If there's only 20 pages, excuse me? Give me five minutes and I'll do them all. He hands out the pages as if they were flies for the biggest concert of the year. Also, aren't they interconnected? What if you... Done. I yeah. hope you'll all agree this is no time for unnecessary hesitation. The sooner we read Ursula's work, the sooner we'll find out if she left any clue to her disappearance. You made him the boss of the affair now. Lazo's face is beat red, but he drops his gaze to the pages before him. I take a look at the now homeless sheets in my hands. Oh, I like that. It looks like a foreword in the opening chapters. They seem to be about family, the Oxians, and I squint at the hastily written notes. A diatribe on life, the future, and her anxiety. I never knew. But one sentence stands out from all the rest. The words sound alien when set against the Ursula I thought I knew. Oh yeah, there's this whole premise of that she doesn't really have a good relationship with her mom. Um, and there is like maybe a tiny twinge of jealousy because Nora had a better relationship with her than uh, Polly did. Bound to live in a world where I drown in the memory of you. The rage inside still hasn't burnt away the tears. I'll meet you again in a fraction of time someday. What are you talking about? Oh, it sounds like you're dead. End. And here we go. Boom, boom, boom. Oh no, I have to. This one is inevitable. Yeah, I can't. I can't. I can't. This one. I guess I'll, I'll get access to the others later. Hmm. Shame washes over me for a moment. Should we be doing this trawling through my mother's secrets? Emma notices my hesitation and beckons me with a jerk of his hand. This feels wrong. But you know as well as I do. That it's the only way. I do. Why did she even give you those pages? Because I asked. She was writing again. For the first time in a long time, she said. She wanted an unbiased opinion, and I, um, offered my services. Could he be unbiased? But you never read them. Once I saw they were poems, I... No. Hmm. I thought she was working on some new Oxion translations. Verse, though. Not my bag. Mine. So much for the enlightened academic shtick. Hmm. My mother's work can get a little... Heavy sometimes. I clench my teeth as I push back the memory. But this new stuff from the notebook, it's full of references to Oxion traditions and rituals. A treasure trove, really. I mean, they said that I think poetry was part of the culture of the Oxians, so maybe this sounds like there's a very distinct link. I'm going to go back to it. Why don't you go and check on the others? They look a little lost. Okay, this note is subject to a timer. Okay! Um, will decrease by one when another note is played. Uh, when time hits zero, the condition will be still resolved. Okay. So, what are our options? Check on Laszlo. Uh, see what, how Nora's doing. I mean, there is no bliss anywhere. Um, I can't open this anyway because I will only have one power crystal. So I will be left with this and Nora over to Umba. So it's inevitable. It must be played to unlock the nerves. 
Do you think the sign is more important? Because we went with Nora last time. I go over to check on Laszlo. His eyes are blurred, his can't as those words, but he hey, looks up as I approach. Done already? Not exactly. Would you look at that? The old man actually came out ahead. I just wrapped these up. Poems, of course. All about family. Our family? He takes a big gulp of that. that bad I'd time. say so. Your mother was. is. Many things, but subtle, no. There's one about relationships, the push and pull of the family unit. Mm. Your mother as a young girl thinking of her future. And the second, uh, well, uh, that one's about a lost love, one she can only find in dreams, unless the gods will it, whatever that means. That doesn't bother you, her talking about love like that, like something out of reach. Look. Your mother's never been a one-man mm. woman. <laughs> she, she was always crystal clear about that. I like her. Her mother's in an open relationship. It took me a while to understand that it isn't a young people thing. It is a regular uh, thing. I love her for that as well. She and Nora... He jerks his head in Nora's general direction. Both helped me to understand that love doesn't bind or restrain. That's my last love. Grizzly bear on the outside, teddy bear on but the But in inside. here, <laughs> she mentions a presence so strong it can be seen in every line. Every word. I've rarely seen such a healthy relationship. I wish I could say the same about me and my mother. I have really no idea which one to choose. And the timer says six choices. Okay, ask her. She sees herself as a new family will be revealing. Something is right, he's hiding something and he has a reason for it. I'm very interested in that one. It's going to fall out to play a lot of balance. I think I have to go with this though. It's so hard to choose. Hang on a Wasn't second. there a third sheet with another poem? I don't think so. Just these two. Actually, I'm a, I think there was a third. Or unless I dropped it. No, no, there was definitely a final poem. Those low shifts pointedly not looking at Omar. Why is he... Oh, but hey, look at these two. Uh, this one talks about a bunch of places we've been to on holiday. The Duquesa Islands, the ferry boat to Magdalena, and this one about a secret lover. <laughs> she wouldn't hide that sort of thing from me. Yes. That's... interesting. Helpful. I can't help but feel that Laszlo isn't being totally honest with me. Is he hiding something? Well, that was a bit pointless. Now, wasn't it? Um, who did she love in the most? That's a big question. 10 billion points. Any guesses? I may have missed something. I'm going with this one. Chaos isn't wrong, but it is not the most important question at the moment in the room. Is it just me or is it getting chilly in here? I look over at Laszlo and yeah, he's clearly uncomfortable to say the least. And now Omo is keeping his distance. Things are getting tense. And I notice something in Laszlo's section. Lines he's trying Laszlo. to hide. Find anything else? He hesitates and... <laughs> look, there was a third poem, okay? I'm sorry, it's just that... It's... What, very sexual? Laszlo, you old softy. Of course you can't keep up a lie for more than five It's minutes. different from the rest. Private. Hm. There are things in there that I don't want you kids seeing. Laszlo, mm -hmm. this isn't the time to go all mama bear on us. If there's something in there that could help... There isn't. At least I don't think there is. All of a sudden I feel like a stranger. I haven't been home in years and here I am knee-deep in my mother's innermost thoughts. Is Laszlo right? Have we gone too far? What exactly are we willing to do to find my mother? None of this is fair to anyone. And we didn't really get an answer.
to do this. To, to check in on both. Nora looks well incensed. She's almost shaking with rage or hey. fear. Everything okay? No reaction. She's glued to her phone, her fingers are blur, say so tap word after Nora? word onto the screen. What? Whoa. Oh. Hey. I just you look a little Polly. Wait. No, uh I'm sorry. I didn't mean to snap. I love these little pauses as well. Ursula's poems. That good, huh? Something like that. They're all about her dreams. How vivid they could be. I've read her work before, and this is by far the most literal I've seen her. According to this, she dreamed a lot about family, us, where we've been, and where we're going. She says that the poems claim that, that she can predict the future. As soon as the words are out, she's back on the phone. Her face has flushed, her mouth tight. What's gotten her so frightened? Well, there's definitely something going on. So, between the power and something lovely has run into the air, the treacherous smell of offness. Okay, these are very vague. But I guess I'd rather go with truth. I don't know, I'm a bit wary of power. That's just me being me, I think. Nora is typing away like a tornado on her phone. I'm too curious to resist the temptation. So she's too focused to notice. I need to warn her to get a clear view of her screen. She's texting someone with great intensity, and I'm going to let Kenneth. great intensity and a lot of words like a lot but the thing is she has the activist phone number so i'm wondering if that's i think that the name was jade i'm wondering if she's messaging jade or maybe she is a spy for the concern <laughs> out of money reasons who are you texting what polly you scared the crap out of me well, kind of up What point. did you do that for? Sneaking around like that? Could have stomped up and slapped you on the back of the head and you wouldn't have noticed. Well, come on, spill. No one. Just a friend. Hey, cut it out. I crane my neck for a better look, but she angles the screen away from me. Wait a minute, Jade? is that? I... Maybe. I was going to, you know, text her. But now I'm not so sure. I didn't know you two were text level friendly. That's so cool. What are you talking about? Nothing. Stuff. Who's the poems, if you must know, they're all about Ursula's dreams, and there's a line about that stuff, Egregor, and predicting the future. I thought it might help with Jade's work, but I don't know. They're just poems. I feel my mouth pull up into a grin. That's clearly not the only reason she was texting Jade. Nora sees my face and blushes. I think crimson. it's a good idea. Texting her. Every little bit helps. You think so? I do. Oh, but be sure to tell Omar too. This is right up his alley. Mm -hmm. The whooshing sensation almost knocks me off my feel. I think that's supposed to be feet, but then you never know. Please, Polly dear, leave Omar out of this. He'll figure it all out eventually. Hmm. Now, Jade and Nora. <laughs> That's where the fun's at. Hmm. Seems Chaos is very preoccupied with Nora. I want to know more about this burgeoning friendship we've got on our hands. And by the look on your face, I'm not the only one. A step back, giving Nora a bit more privacy. No, this is this is not what we're concerned about. And I can't go to yours anyway, because um have one bomb crystal which I don't so I can only go this way. Oh shit, I think the other one opened. Nora scoops up the sheets containing us. Time to bones. have a chat with Omar, I guess. Yes. We need to tell him about the Egregor. All the dream stuff. Hopefully it'll help. Sounds like a plan, Nora, despite the circumstances. I'm happy we're doing this together. 
We smile at each other. I mean, they're basically sisters. Nora had been a precious addition to what I can call my family. Ursula welcomed her and let's love without hesitation. And I, I did so. too. I'm happy we're doing something good together. Oh no. <laughs> Don't say anything else, please. Nora and I used to create these elaborate pranks. We would move furniture and artwork across the layers at night when everybody was partying and these were the days before I left and before something changed with my I mother. I know we will find her. A smile, as if Nora could I read know. my mind. Despite our relationship, I want to get her back. I know. Let me talk to Omar. This will cheer him up. She gives me a little eye roll and strides over to Oma, whose face immediately lights up as she starts to explain. Good. Any clue is a good clue at this point. Okay. Ah, confusion. Okay, because this one opened. Oof. We're all over the place. I hear a sign that Oma places his pages down on a desk. His eyes are closed like he's meditating on the words he just so? read. You took your time. Oh, I so much in here. Poetry, of course. The very precise descriptions of rituals and cultural artifacts even I've never heard of. I don't know how she came up with half the knowledge there is in this. Come on. Time to compare notes. Hopefully something in here will point us in the right direction. I hope. I do hope we will get somewhere with this. Next choice. Yeah, I forget. Well, I don't have powers, so I have to go with this. Either way, I didn't even read it. Everyone gathers around the kitchen counter. Let's go shaking his head, no, white as a sheet. They're all looking to me. Let's all right, Laszlo, why don't you start? Well, your mother remains mm -hmm. as mysterious as ever. I can tell you that for free. My sections were all about love. Love for us, our family. But also for someone else in in a faraway land. Totally inaccessible somehow. This sparks something in Omar. He snatches up his pages, flicking through them. Good luck making sense of that. I'm wondering if she's talking about the reverie. No, no. That does make sense. Here, look. In my sections too, there's talk of a reunion with this faraway land. And another being. Mm -hmm. The story reminds me of various myths. And many cosmogenies start with the reattachment of a split soul. Okay, you lost me on half of that sentence. Lazarus' face sags just a bit. I want to reach out to him, touch his arm, but Oma can. Ursula seemed obsessed with this ritual. This idea of becoming whole. Mm, which. It. it all reminds me of the Oxion belief in realm crossing and the prescience. They wrote extensively on the subject. They said by using the holy Ica, the prescience could transcend this plane and access another. How's a bunch of fairy tales going to help us? Hmm? Not fairy tales. These were literal beliefs. This sacred liquid. They called it Egregor. Pools of it were said to exist across Atina. Egregor? Jade talked about that. And look, my section mentions Egregor too. Prescience. The Oxions believed that there were those who could see the future. Literally see it laid out before them. And the egregor would enhance their abilities. We saw that logo somewhere. For a moment, I can't breathe. I feel as if a fist is clenched in my chest. Am I a person? The last time I saw Ursula, she mentioned them. I didn't think it was relevant to all this. But now... You said this egregor stuff was just... Uh, lying around the island? Yes. No. The sacred pools were said to be well hidden. We... We talked about trying to find them, but... MK has laid claim to every inch of Atina. And MK has approached people, offering them health, benefits, um, healing, whatever, with Egregor. Nora was right. This sounds shockingly similar to Jade's investigation. A cold wave washes over me. Is all of this linked? I don't know why I didn't see it before. I believe there's a very real chance Ursula went to find a prescient ritual site. A crossover point. That's what I said. Silence. No one knows what to say. To everyone else, it must seem ridiculous, but to me, the aspirations, reverie, Ursula, everything is connected. Okay, so. Are we 
would have needed to over there. I don't remember, but I think it just means that it is inevitable of skills that just come. I don't think I had a choice anyway. Had enough of Laszlo's distractions. There, sequestered away beneath an errand chopping block, is the first page. My arm darts past him before he can react. I snag the sheet and yank it out like some pernicious. Hey, meat. Polly, no, 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 no. G give that. That's not for you. I'm not a child anymore, Laszlo. We need all the leads we can get. Please, Polly. There's nothing in there except. Um, I, I don't want you hurt worse than you already are. I don't need protecting. I didn't say you... Hmm. Look, you know how your mother got. Her moods. Those words, they don't mean anything. Well, if they don't mean anything, we can read them. I walk away, not in the mood for a therapy session, right in the middle of the kitchen. Looking down, the poem is peppered with bizarre symbols. Did Laszlo have breath there? That's, um... The Oxion symbol. For motherhood. Omo speaks from over my shoulder. Without even looking, I can picture the concern on his face from how he drips from his Are words. you going to try and stop me too? No. But Ursula is your mother. And with her gone, these are yours, as far as I'm concerned. Just... Try not to take any of that poem to heart. I'm sure she... I'm sure it's nothing personal. My stomach lurches. Now I'm afraid. Maybe I shouldn't read this after all. the word yeah. again I can't even do these one of your mother's deepest secrets well it might be the key to understanding her better the food fly lands on the sheet I brush it away and start to read thanks to Irma the poem makes at least some kind of sense motherhood is woven throughout the simile and rhetoric both it's complex and unwieldy beast. <laughs> Sorry, of contradictions and absurdity. It does sound quite well but there's no masking the heart of it. I shouldn't have read this. This is I, I should Hey. Have. It's okay. Nora's hand comes to rest lightly on my shoulder. I can Polly, you can. Maybe it's best if you stop now. But I'm already done. Place the paper on the counter as my vision clouds. Part of me wants to throw those words into a fire. He never wanted the other. me. Through the haze, I feel less low. Polly, approach. sweetheart. Motherhood was nothing but a colossal disappointment to her. I mean, I understand. I think. I mean, I left, didn't I? But we were never good enough for her. Any of us. I no longer control the words coming out of my mouth. This isn't helping anyone. Why am I still... And now we know why. This mm. love story for the ages. Nothing ever compared to it. Not for her. And we're sat here playing detective when the truth is obvious. It's obvious. She wasn't kidnapped. She left us. No one's looking at anyone else. The image of this new Ursula, however we each interpret it, has cast a glum pal of the... Look. Look. I don't know any of you, beyond what Ursula said, but we need to be real here. I think you may be right. Ursula wasn't kidnapped. She wasn't taken. She chose to disappear. But I don't think it was over some romance. She was too smart for that. If she did this, left without a trace, it must have been the last possible resort. Yeah. Why try as Oracle? Plain objective, uh, plain objective related to truth. That's all it takes the floor. I know just his hand was shaking poems, slightly. They mention a few different Oxion ritual sites. Might as well try them. But only a few of them seem to relate back to this mystery 
love of hers. We can narrow down those locations even further if we only look at those associated with the prescience. If Ursula did leave to find one of these sites, it's almost certainly a temple. Most of them are underground. Underground? Even in their heyday, there were those who thought certain rituals profane. Well, pro. Most of Athena's archaeological sites are pretty well documented. Con, it's because they're all owned by MK. I've tried for years to get access to even a minor site. Nada. Completely off limits. So, everything Ursula wrote suggests she went on some sort of personal quest to cross between realms and find her love. And she needed an Oxion temple to get there. Exactly. So the big question is, did she find a way to get into that temple? Or did something get to her before she could? Empty chaos crystals, unfortunately not. So I can't do that. Although I did one in the last chapter where I didn't have the crystals I needed and I still somehow got through, so... No one has an answer for all drained while I'm drained. It's within and out of my mind at random. It's so many different plans. You know what we don't know, and that's about it. Ursula left by choice. And didn't return because she was successful in her mission or because she wasn't. It hurts. My worry for my mother is tangled up with anger now and more than a bit of hope. We know this much. Jade's investigation into MK and Ursula's disappearance are related. That's... something. Yes, that's something. <sighs> Sorry. So why aren't we asking her for help? Jade, I mean. She said she was willing. And I'm sure if she helped us, we'd help her. <laughs> Mutually assured reconstruction. You just want to have a reason to message her, but as bad I... as... I... That's a good idea, actually. Yeah. Yeah. That could work. Worst case, she can cause a distraction somewhere so nobody sees her sneaking into a temple. Jade. Jade Galea. You're friends with her? S sort of. <laughs> friends with Athena's most well-known activist. Impressive. Okay, okay. We have a plan. Now that's a real plan. Been to I'm gonna go to the skate park. Like, right now. This is too important for online messaging. It's all monitored by MK anyway. Safer this way. If she is there. Oh, hey, fine. just... Take care. Watch yourself out there. All right, Grandpa. It's the skate park, not a war zone. Anyway, good luck, Nora. I'll be careful. I'm not entirely sure the plan is the only reason Nora wants to see Jade in person. But at least we have one, or the beginnings of one. Laszlo mumbled something under his breath and leaves. The reality of the situation returns and I want to go after him. But I don't. He needs to be alone, to process what my mother has done. She was always unpredictable, but this? This is further than she's ever gone before. Chaotic, even. Speaking of, the link between my mother and the aspiration of chaos remains unclear. I haven't heard from Bliss or the others, so I assume they've had no luck in prying them from their maze. The only move is to keep searching and hope the truth reveals itself. Interesting fun. And the truth. End of chapter. It's a very interesting narration style. There's a stain on the chopping block. Tomato, maybe? Or pepper? A red slash of colour across the wood. I think about fetching a cloth and wiping it away, but I don't. I sit with the others digesting the situation. Laszlo tears into some bread. Irma sips his glass of water like a hummingbird. Phone in hand. Nora still at the skate park. I finger a splinter, working it loose from the counter, thinking. And not thinking. We are digesting. looking for a temple. That's what swallows his mouth while looking up at the news member of our record. Yes, I think we got that. All the underground temples on Athena are under MK's jurisdiction. Locked down. For preservation purposes. What a load of horseshit. Mm. That damn company. They'll be the death of this island. Mm. The locations themselves are secret. They don't really want anyone near them. Because they probably can't 
secure all of them constantly, 24-7. But look here. Athena's rich archaeological history is safe in the hands of our very own urban planning department. And there's a contact number. Well, that's worth a shot. Surely. Is it? The deeper we dive into this mess, the more convinced I am that MK is far more than an independent observer. Hmm, I mean, stories like this and big companies, yeah. They've always had an agenda when it comes to Athena, and now it looks like we're about to put ourselves directly in so, their way. So, should I give them a call? Lazar and Irma glance at each other and then at me. They clearly have different ideas on how to proceed. Ah, now we're gonna have to pick between the two. Irma's advice, Lazlo's advice. I've always trust Lazlo's opinion. You're giving unbiased opinion. I think unbiased is better. I look over at Irma. He puts his phone down and leans Omar? forward on the counter. How would you go about it? We're swimming into unknown waters here. We need to be smart, tactical, discreet. Yeah, this is what we need. The last thing we want is to draw MK's attention. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So not an emotional re re um, response. Yeah. As he speaks, Bond's silhouette seems to materialize I next like to him. I like him. I like his voice and his ideas. I agree with him. A less violent path is the one I would recommend. I focus on my attention. So. Now. An idea. You call the urban planning department, but not as Polly. Hide my identity. He nods, biting his lip. Won't be as simple as making up a name. It'll be a vid call. And those surveillance cameras of theirs are everywhere for a reason. They'll know who you are as soon as they pick up. But I just got here. To Atina. Sure, I'm probably in the system, but I haven't even used my credit card yet. No way they know my name. Well, I mean, the camera picked you up and scanned you as soon as you arrived with the boat. I'll ask for ID. Maybe more. Their systems are watertight. Omar's face Unlike their up. infrastructure, the whole island is like... Swiss cheese under the surface. Just last week, there was an urban planning rep on TV talking about flooding. If you pose as... As a plumber, a private contractor, helping with the leaks... They might buy it. People were pretty mad about that flood. If they're gonna give info out to anyone, it'll be someone helping them clean up their mess. Okay. Worth mm -hmm. a try, at least. I mean, what's the worst that could happen? Don't get too ahead of yourself, dear. Take your time. We'll be right here. You can follow Omar's advice or think of something else. Either way, I need to act. It's not a bad idea. I just need to know... I fish my phone from my pocket and dial the number Omar reads out. He and Leslo are both looking at me with a mix of encouragement and concern. The line beeps and beeps. The ringtone continues for what feels like ages. Maybe this wasn't such a good thing. Welcome to Mono Concern. Your call is important to us. Your expected sway time is... The machine's voice is lodged deep somewhere in the uncanny valley. Your call may be recorded for security and training purposes. Leslo mouths a cuss. Omar sighs, but no one's suggesting I stop. Bizarre accent is replaced by equally grating music. I'm definitely having second thoughts now. What if? Urban planning department. This is Yana Seyavong speaking. Oh shit! I mean, hello. <laughs> um, hi. This is urban planning. Can I help you? Wait, Polly, is that you? Oh shit! Lasso's eyes bug out of his head. That is off. you, Polly. Is Yana from my school? Oh my god! That's them all right. Yana. We were friends, I guess, in high school. Another day done. Truth be told, I had a pretty big crush on them. That's probably what stopped me from getting closer to them. Oh. My vision swims as the aspirations... Think fast, approach. but think carefully. Forge bravely ahead. You already know the path you must take. Stay true to yourself and your instincts. They will serve you well. I'm trying to, but it's not easy. We're trying to tell a story here, but also... Okay, wait, why... This is so different. True, maybe things could have been easier to get on your mother. Reveal your identity. Why would they hurt you? I don't know. I think that's dumb as well. I mean, she literally just recognizes. I 
will gain a bond crystal and I don't actually mind that. Okay, this is fine, perhaps even good. There was a point, moment in time, when Jana and I might have become something else, together, but I never, I couldn't. Ancient size and urban planning. <laughs> oh boy. All right, the plan's shot to pieces, no point lying. Let's see if Jana's the person I always hoped they were. I mean, they can sort of think for themselves, but yeah, it was a bit suspicious. Um, because they were oh. Like oh no, they don't work for This okay. is, what are the chances? Yeah, seriously, who would have thought? I mean, she immediately recognized her lying would have been the worst possible thing to do. The last time I saw you was graduation wow. day? No, wait, the week after. The party at Sarah Macri's place. Yeah, I remember. Out of the corner of my eye, I spot Laszlo trying to catch my attention. He's mouthing something. You're being recorded. Meanwhile, Omo's motioning so, me for me to continue. How are you? Good. 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 I mean, great. It seemed the same as they were in high school. A little distant, hard to read. This is off watch already. I need to figure out what to say next. <laughs> Here come my problems, I guess. Okay, so we've done that. Okay. So between bond and between truth. Strike up a conversation. I mean, I kind of want to, but again, that is not the issue. You're thinking of seriously if you're straightforward. Yeah, I'm going with truth. Following the rule. Collect 20 truth When did I get 20 truth crystals? I, I, I don't know. The, the math is not mathing, I'm just saying. No distractions, stick to the facts. This is Yana, I can trust him. I think. I give Omo a nod. I've got this. He seems reassured enough. Laszlo, on the other hand, Laszlo's whispering a steady stream of advice and anxiety. I can't make any of that. Probably be the better. For the bettest. I wanted to put better and best together. It's probably for the best. Yana's staring at me from the other side of the call, confusion written all over their face. <sighs> Sorry? I need to get away from Laszlo's hand banging. I mouth a few words at him, trust me, and walk away from Everything him. Everything okay over there? Hmm? Oh yeah, yeah. I'm just... You remember my old place? People coming and going at all hours of the day? Right, right. So, urban planning. You did call urban planning, right? This is it. You're no, going no. back now. My mother's missing. That's why I'm back. And we have reason to believe she might have gone to one of MK's temple sites. A pause. A long one. Confusion, surprise, and caution. Fight for control of the Anna's expression. What makes you think she's there? Those locations are completely sealed off. It's complicated. She left a note. Kind of. A series of poems. All the signs point in one direction. She wanted to find a temple. An Oxion temple. Those are all controlled by your department. I mean, if we had spoken to any other person, we could have stuck with the plumber plan. But the fact that she immediately recognized us. Ah, come on, I kind of want to, but... Let's go for Bond this time. I, I'm, I'm trying to balance it all out. Yana chews the inside of their mouth, their eyes focus on the point past the camera. Enough to get your mom. Nobody ever forgets about she my She was quite sophisticated and stubborn. So were you, if I remember correctly. Ouch. Not reacting to that. Absolutely not reacting to that. What did you immediately think of the temples we're protecting, though? Why the Oxions? Her poems are filled with them. Their culture, their rituals, their holy sites. I... I wouldn't be calling if it wasn't our main lead. Silence. They bite their lip and I quickly look away to hide the blush that's risen to my cheeks. They're still our best hope. Our only hope. We're rubbing more and more people into this, so on occasion I definitely agree that Bond is a better choice. All information on Oxygen Temple sites is classified for public safety. I'm not yep. sure what else to say. But this is about public safety. Well, the safety of one of the public. Shit. Um... I hate seeing Yana like this. Even though we've become strangers, I recognize that look on their face. 
They're freaking out, completely unsure what path to take. Yes, it's an old lady. I could lose my job talking about this. They're considering it. Actually, I could lose a whole lot more than that. If anyone ever calls this vidlock up, it's over. Can she delete it? You already just the fact that you literally just admitted that you're thinking about it probably already incriminated you, so you might as well just go for it now. I hate this. Truly hate this, but I'm in too deep. There's no other Yana, option. Yana, I'm so sorry to ask. I hope you know I wouldn't if there was any other way. I know you wouldn't. You were always so... So... What? They left the sentence trail off for way too long. So what? I'm sorry, ma'am. Will you excuse me for just one second? They mute a comment and turn to someone off camera. Every now and again they shoot me a sidelong glance that's impossible to read. Of course, somebody walked in. Um... I don't know if I should do a wait and see. Appeals to their emotions. Ha! <sighs> wait and see, there's nothing one can do, it's in their hands now. I mean, we have the crystals for this. We might as well use it. The call's still on mute. Yana's listening to their colleague. Panic. I feel it rising. This whole call was a mistake, but I can salvage it. I have to. Yana seems to be done. They unmute the call and turn back to me. It has Sorry, to be now. I don't have long before they come back. Rules exist for a reason, Harmony. Yeah, to just... bend them to your will. To crush them when they stand in your way. Why in this case? Hey, um... Do you remember Sarah's party at all? What am I doing? This feels so wrong. I didn't mean to manipulate her. I... yeah? Yes, I think so. I didn't know anyone. Except you, of course. I was late. First year of high school. Thrown into a mix of new faces I didn't know and old faces I'd rather forget. I think quite like the feeling of being the only stranger at a party. And when you arrived... Yeah, I remember. You, we spent the whole evening together. Yeah. And Polly, you don't need to. I'm sorry. But now it's like I'm at that party again. <laughs> I don't know what to do, and the only person I know is you. It's not a lie. Lazlo catches my eye and nods gently. I'm doing Look, this stop it, okay? Stop. I guess I went too far, huh? Here they go again, back to their colleague. I shake my head, trying to make sense of whatever's going on. I don't think it was that terrible. And now we can do the wait and see anyway. But we, we sprinkled in a tiny bit more motivation. Call still on mute, Yana's listening to the colleague, I don't know what to do. When they're done, they unmute the call and turn back to me. I'll wait I to see to what do they something. have to say. Quickly, I won't be long. Oh, okay, sure. They mute to call again, this time stepping out of the frame. I wonder if this is different now from if I had not used the other one. Leslo and Omo look at me expectantly. I shrug. Who knows what the other's up to? Hopefully finding the location. Okay, it seems... I have to go this way? I, 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 I don't know. I might be messing this up so much. I'm not sure what it's else to just, say. It was... Cool, seeing you again. Caught me off guard, I guess. Yeah, I can see that. It makes me want to catch up properly, you know? Really talk about where we've both been, what we've been up to. Uh -huh. Like, whatever happened to Annalise? You folks were dating, right? For a while. Wow, bringing up old dating history. Yeah, well, we broke up ten years ago. Ten years? When was I? Ah, yes. On the continent, studying neurology see? every waking hour. That's what I mean. I've missed so much. Maybe if we had a chat, I'd stop putting that foot of mine right in my mouth. <laughs> a chance. This is excruciating. I mean... Oh, I could go this way. Wow. That's a lot of crystals. No, I don't want to go. <gasps> I can't go this way. <gasps> and I know I can't go this way. I can't. I can't. I don't have enough truth. Oh my god, I have to go this way. Fuck my life. The sighing. Is that a sigh? It looks like a sigh. Okay, let's not drag this out, alright? I don't understand. Here, I'm sending you the location. Biggest 
assemble on the island right under MKHQ. Top security. Fuck. I get it, you know? Desperate times. If my mom went missing, I'd do anything to find her. But Good. being pumped for information, that's low. You know I would have helped you out anyway, right? Eh. Hey. I. Shit. It's disrespectful. Let's go back. Yeah, it's been a while. Yeah, I work for MK. Oh, she does. But I'm still the same person. Ooh, I hope no. I am. Ah, uh, see, you're not so sure yourself. Can I hear a hint of doubt? I know you are. Place? I'm sorry if. Forget it. Whatever you're about to do, just don't get caught. And I hope you find Ursula. And with that, they're gone. Basil and Irma grin broadly and give me the thumbs up, but I feel. You Regret, did shame? what needed to be done efficiently. Uh, I don't like signing Your with you. victory is what matters. All other considerations are secondary. <sighs> Be proud. We move a step closer to our goal. Maybe Power's words are what I needed to hear. I feel slightly better. But to be fair, I mean. Being put on the spot in a stressful situation like that with absolutely no plan, I think it is very human to make this, these mistakes. I think I'll just stick with it. Because in the end that's just where it was, but also there was this whole like uh, nice move theory. Play an objective related to chaos and you did well play an objective related to chaos. Wow, there's a lot of power in there. Okay. It could have gone another way, sure. But here we are. Walking up my line. But this is Lazarus Bar. We were torn between making a gin tonic and making coffee. To be fair, it's almost 1am. Back at the bar, everything seems shockingly normal. Laszlo stands tall behind the counter, idly cleaning a glass that's already sparkling. Omer scanning through a pocket diary, jolting, jotting down a note every now and then. Despite the rumble of the trams above, it's quiet. And hey, um... Hi, Polly. Hey, Jade. Jade's the last person I expected to see again. Last time she looked exhausted, one small push away from collapsing entirely. But here she is. She looks great, buzzing with energy, even if her shoulders are hunched and her eyes are ever so slightly clouded. Nora follows close behind. Thought we behind. could use all the help we could get. She blushes and readjusts her beanie. When she sees me smiling, she rolls her eyes but can't help but grin back. The newcomers take tools by the counter. The gang's all here, waiting so, for me. This is harder than I thought. First, the good news. We know where Ursula is. Where she might be. More correctly. Well, yes. Second, the bad news. We need to act. Even if it means heading to MKHQ. Do we suspect that they have an elevator all the way down to the tank? Which is, yeah. A lot. There was a reason I was never elected to class president. Where to start? He's always been good under pressure. Arm control. Well, we've got a crew at least. That's a start. You lot aren't exactly hardcore resistance fighters, but I've seen worse. <laughs> Something sparkles between her and Nora lightning. I already said I'm all in, if that helps. Oh, that's appreciated. It does actually. Support is the only thing I have right now. Support, comfort, and plans. We haven't been to Reverie yet again, because I'm, I'm starting to get worried what's going on over there. Actually, quite a lot when you think We're about it. We're here too, you know. Thank you, Bliss. We will aid you in any way we can. The closer you come to your goal, the more egregor you acquire. The more power we have available to penetrate Chaos's hiding place. But, but, hmm, I haven't decided if I want to break in there. Why do I get the impression it's going to be me going into that maze of theirs? Well, because as I said, unless invited, they can't. I need to concentrate on the All here right, and now. Let's hear your ideas. There are no wrong answers. That's good stuff. We should say that in class. Okay. Attack from the inside, attack from the outside. Unexpected anti MK alley. Mama has been hiding in the important information all along. Yeah. Oh, 
I get my game of bombed? Yeah, because this is bombed and true twice, or just power, which I definitely I don't want to go to power. Gain 10 truth, and this would be gain 10 bond. I technically want to work towards this, whatever it is. So just as we were saying. Let's see here, bond and chaos might be an idea. Yeah, because I don't want to do power unless I do this. Which I could do. This is unavoidable. Again, one power regardless. Conversion, open door, close door. You can fend for yourself. Oh, I don't like the sound of that. Wait for Omar. Think and overthink. Yes, we don't know. The Oxian Temple. Okay, hard choices. Hard, very hard choices for Jade friends. <sighs> New eyes open eye. Yeah. Yeah, those are inevitable. The ones with the swords are inevitable. I don't really want to go inside, so we're gonna go with the outside. I'd rather stick with the girls. Tell me. Oops. I Shit. know you have something in mind. Um. No, I. Well, I remembered something, and it's no, no, it's nothing. Tell her. I missed that It's one. a proper plan, and I know all about proper plans. Behind the counter, Leslo chuckles, a cocktail of pride and amusement. I do trust Nora. Okay. Almost. Well, back Go when it through. first opened, I took a tour of MK Tower. Oh, nice. Yeah, loving truth, to be honest, androgynous and otherworldly is a great vibe. Yeah, it does. I, I do love that this is the second game um, this year we've played with such characters. Um, because it reminds me of the one that was like the musical. Um, the one that Laura Bailey is is the main voice for, but obviously I uh, also with the gods because um, Truth kind of gives me a bit the vibes of Hades in that one. Um, wait, game singing Laura Bailey. Why do I always forget that? Um, Stray Gods, that was the one. Yeah, it reminds me a lot of the character designs in Stray Gods as well. Even those were more gender presenting. Um, there, there, there was a lot of fluidity as well, especially with Hades, and that's where yeah, Truth gives me kind of a similar vibe, like strict but well-meaning. Done it myself, scouting. Bloody awful experience. It was, but the guide made a point of telling us all about the area, how the tower was built. <laughs> Oh yeah, I really fancy that now I've seen a has been. Oh, I can imagine. And I'm, I'm, I am very strongly considering my Camilla Carmine cosplay, perhaps for May. I also invited another friend. Um, I might get a bit chaotic with hotel rooms and stuff, but we'll see. Um, we'll talk about that in private. Um, oh, it's actually, you know him. Um, he is the one that was queuing with me at FanFest for the autographs. So, because he was going to the near concert, and sorry, just for anyone that's watching the stream later, he wrote on Twitter. He was going to near concert, but cancelled, and I said, "Well, you could join us at MCN Comic Con in May. That might be relevant to anyone who wants to ever meet me, because <laughs> I will be there." Um, so yeah, the only thing that puts me off is that Camilla's outfit is very clown-like. I mean, I love the ballerina on plant style with the tights, which I guess I can do with leggings or like some kind of material but um, I actually hate the top and I'm not looking forward to styling that week but yeah I do love velvet as well but velvet's hair is just as insane actually a lot of them do have some, some clown references which reminds me of Fizzle Rowley the um foundations foundations the temple he even much. pointed out which door led down there plan is to book a tour and sneak away. Take a trip downstairs. Eh, that might work. It's bold. Bold and crazy. Bold and crazy and dangerous. No. Why? What? No. 
That's absurd. You'll be caught, arrested, guaranteed. So what, I have what, to admit, case? it's a lot. When did anyone manage to change things? Really change things without taking a few risks? <sighs> All this is the tip of something. A conspiracy, the end of society, whatever. And Ursula's our way in. We need to save her for her sake. But in the end, she's... She's just... Her voice trembles. Drop. A drop in an ocean of oppression and violence. MK must be stopped. Okay, because we know that he was hiding something, but I'm very glad to hear this out of his mouth. It's about more than just us today. More than just the here and now. He's right. We can't avoid taking risks any longer from now, and every action we take is a gamble, the odds stacked against us. And I mean, we've learned enough, at the very least, from Gremlins 2. Um, but yeah, for being part of a tournament and sneaking away definitely works. He glances at Laszlo. He drops his head in desperate agreement. No matter how much he lost his granddaughter, okay. he's in. Tell me more. Take it slow, check every corner, doubt every fact. I can see the future, but I can't change the past. I can't forget that. Oh, I could go there as well. Bring a jammer. Versions always work in movies, right? Oh. Okay, wait. Let's see. Okay, wait, wait. So this is the backup that would unlock this one. We broke two notes, but yeah, those are the power ones. I'm gonna take this in the gym, but I'm taking to the jammer will lead us on this path. Which does still open this and this one. Okay, so we're going with pajama. Jade breaks. Gizmos! Huh? Gizmos! Love me some gizmos! Could bring a jammer. Standard kit for a citizen revolutionary. Might give us an edge. How does it work? Neutralizes drones. Other MK shit. Feedback loops their com relay. Sends them into temporary shutdown. Could slow them down and give us more time to find Ursula. We could use some of those at the Nyads. Yeah. Yeah, we could. The jam is small. Discreet. Can't hurt to bring it along. If we go that route, it could come in handy. If. He wants to protect us. He cares about all of us. It's just how he is. Okay. Okay. I mean, I could still check this out. I do, I do want to know if I, if I can get all of this. I'm going to raise his hand politely. He's obviously thought long and hard I about what you say. Connections. What kind of connections? People. People who can get us through New Elysia. Straight to the tower. Safely. Quietly. That's very convenient. Dave narrows her eyes at Omer. He meets her gaze, smiling a little. After a moment, she smiles back. Maybe she isn't the only one fighting the good fight. It's too early to promise anything. And I don't want to involve my people before I know I can trust you. All of you. Wait. <laughs> trust us. I don't know you. Not really. I know your mother, Polly. And I know her intentions are good. But... Sorry. There are a lot of new faces here. And trust is earned. Not given. No offense. None taken. I think. I press on before last night. Hard to commit out. to a plan we know nothing about, though. I've always looked at these things like... Jazz. I sense Lazarus ears and pick up. You know, we might have finally found something. We agree on a harmony. We write the chords. Then we jam. From beginning to end, until everybody's played their part. I can get us through New Elysia into MK Tower. From there, well, all Jads needs a little improv. Another silence. He's right. Done. The anger is gone. Nothing like a jazz band foot to come out of Bruce. What's together. inside those ruins is a mystery. We have a plan to get in. You're welcome. And we need a plan to get out. Got that covered. These are good contacts. Nobody else for details. So, if we do this, we're going to have to trust you, even though you don't trust us. Look, I like you. All of you. As much as I can after, <laughs> what, a few hours? But Ursula's a vital part my research and she's my friend i'm here for her you can trust me on that his words have to ring of truth to them his plan is to improvise creativity above surety it's bold risky can we trust him hmm. yeah i don't know if it does um 
so think I'd do Rosie if you went with Camilla. I'm just worried because Rosie, you need fucking top A veneers because of those teeth if you want to make them. Making the huge hat sounds so fun and the makeup wouldn't be difficult. I don't know, how would you do the eyes? Doesn't she have like two black gaping holes for eyes? If you can get blackout contacts though. Um, you'd need sclera. Um, and not just mini sclera, probably full sclera. I do own some mini scleras. Um, but especially if you're not used to colored contacts, which I am like for over a decade, um, it's, it's really hard and very tiring to wear them, especially if you're not used to sclera. And sclera are like, I struggle very, very hard to get mine in at all. Um, same as other people just struggle with normal con color contacts to get them in because sometimes the eye shape is really not in favor of doing that. So, just saying. Um, and yeah, it's a bit questionable because anything that's completely blackout or whiteout is really hard to see through. Um, at most, I mean, you might be able to have your teeny tiny pupil to see through but it's not guaranteed because I also had uh, completely whited out contact lenses uh, which I've used for some photo shoots and uh, you, you literally can't see anything like I had to be guided um, with hands <laughs> and needed help with the posing because I literally couldn't see anything especially if you look into light you're fucked you can't see anything um, so we'll see about that I've also been thinking to maybe drop the uh, late evening plan in favor of like a more relaxed evening because, I, I mean, I know because I've done it once before that I can I can party all night and still go to the convention the next day and be fine. Um, but yeah, depending on how many people we are now gathering, um, making a nice dinner and cocktail plan might be more worthwhile. We'll see. Uh, let's see what he thinks first. Oh yeah, uh, zoom out a bit because there's all the connection. Oh God. To this far? For real? Okay, you're linking to this one, which comes from <sighs> I guess I'm going with this. Reveal that. I've been putting off talking to Leslie since he arrived. He's constantly vibrating with tension. This isn't heading in the right direction. What do you mean? These plans, they're, they're barely even ideas. They're what ifs, maybes. He's Polly, not wrong. you're going to get yourself thrown in jail. Or worse. So does it If you fail, he's definitely we need not. to act. And this isn't your forte, kid. I. I'm sorry. Kid? But you know what I mean. None of us are experts in this stuff, you included. Kind but of we have to try. So what am I going to do? Hmm? Stay here while you all risk your lives. But yes, I agree that it would be nice to do like one day has been and one day uh effort for two. Wait for the sirens and the MK officials knocking down my door. Honestly? Yes. Blunt? I love you, blunt. Laszlo, but we need discretion. And that isn't your forte. Discretion? You're going to talk to me about discretion after that little call of yours? Hell, I'm surprised we haven't seen your face on the news. Imposter infiltrates MK. Have you seen this girl? Girl. Huh. Yeah, I really don't like his choice of vocabulary. I know it once was good for us, for me. I really do, Grandpa, but... Grandpa, stop. Please. I don't know who the voice actor is. You need to trust Polly. Again. You need to trust all of us. Whatever happens. <sighs> Blast. I, I just... Please. Behind his eyes, gears are turning. He signs up like a deflating balloon, the energy I... seeping out of him. He's shaking his hand almost in the morning. Look at me. When did I become a bloody pushover? Since there are adult women who can, or otherwise presenting, uh, who can speak can for themselves. Can you stay behind? Promise? I'll... I need to hear it. I promise. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Job, Thank you, all of you. From the corner of my eyes, I see Omer smiling. It's faint but genuine. I look at Laszlo giving him a smile and a nod. He nods back and plants the cleanest glass the world has ever seen on the bar. Hey, anything to keep one occupied, right? Okay, I still have time to think. Palms on the table, warp plastic Let's go. my fingers. 
I'll... I'll make up my mind on the way. Hmm. Whatever... Whatever the, <laughs> whatever the mood was before I spoke, it's gone now. Whatever the plan was before I stood up, it's now in motion. One by one, we leave our tables and stools. Lasno lowers the shot to closing the bar. No turning back now. This is where the food shop was. We walk in silence for a few minutes along the busy streets. Food stands, while the vendors crowd the traps. Also, I literally just realized that I had been. Um, uh, I hate to tell you, know what they're called anymore. <laughs> but I made like, like, the noises I made is like a tick, and I didn't know I was making it until after I thought about it. Then Jade speaks, almost a whisper okay. directly into my ear. Drones above our hats. The bus must be looks less like a pig compared to the last one. They both look mosquitoes on the hot summer evening. Everything's going to be alright. Split up. Suddenly I feel like I'm on full display, an actor in a show performing for unseen A complex eyes. situation. Mm, so you can say them twice. It's been a while. I've been wondering when they'd show up again. I keep walking, keep watching True. for the watchers. Guess that's how you got your name, huh? Do not be blinded by pride. Face the reality. Of the task ahead. A low hum fills my head. I'm trying. Out. You must all come together. Seek cohesion through communion. Yeah, but I don't think there is a, a way to do a bit of both. Bond, supportive, and his. We have a plan. You have a seed of an idea. You need to come up with a plan. Not helping. There's no time for doubt. Only for action. Decisive. Action, Polly. Seize the moment. Denied. Everyone's here. It's a real party. Blaze, where are Please, you? You're not helping any of you. Then you're not listening. How can I when you're each trying to send me down different paths towards different outcomes? The future is like a car with no brakes, careening out of control. All I can do is choose which Polly? road it goes down. You all right? Thanks, Nora. We're here, a few blocks outside your new hey. injured quarter. My head's still pounding, but at least it's just... Stress gets the best of us, mate. Just try not to stumble about like a... Like a sleepwalker. Fine. I'm fine. Thinking. If you don't believe me, I will This is it. Me. Up to you now, Polly. What's it going to be? Their eyes and their hopes are all focused on me. The problem is... Yeah, I'm stuck. This is obviously way more complex, and there's three that are unavoidable. It must be played, but also this one. There's going to be one of the two. This one I would lose the bond. The only one I have. I definitely don't want to go with this path. If it would be, yeah, one of the girls, losing one of the girls, absolutely not. I don't know what's needed, I'm not quite cold for backup. They seem so confident and this looks like fun. I don't think that's a good way to deal with this. Deus <coughs> Ex Machina has always been voting. This way might be safe depending on how much armor is hiding from us. That is the other problem. Because I, I, I want bond crystals in this one. This is the truth crystal though, so we gain truth but nothing else. And as I said, I kind of want to get to this one. Traditions have two bond crystals and have one truth crystal. I 
do have the truth crystal, but I need another bomb, so... I have to go down this path if I want to get that answer. Fuck me. To be fair, my dumbass would make this decision. Jade, I've made up my mind. Nora. The three of us have a good shot at infiltrating the place without being noticed. Noma doesn't react. Laszlo definitely isn't happy, but a look from his granddaughter kills his oncoming barrage of words. I know it's begins. dangerous, but we can be quicker and more discreet this way. And we're not endangering Elmer's friends. Laszlo's jaw is tied, but he keeps I'm responsible for the girls. If anything happens, I'll make sure they get away. Understood? Well, one of the pops didn't sound if, like it. If you say so. Okay. We'll see you at home. Home. What a strange word. Ooh. When I ask my friends, uh, my students, my friends, my students, what home meant to them. It was quite an interesting topic last year. The group splits. The girls and I start towards MK Tower. Home. At Athena was my home. And now, now I have to crane my neck like a bird watcher to see the summit of the monstrous building before us. Okay, yeah. The tower isn't a bird, quite the opposite. It's oppressive, an ugly phallus of glass and steel. Thank you for pointing out the phallocentrism. The tours leave from that booth over there. Time to blend in. We're tourists. Easy for me. It's basically true. You two, act happy. Big mm -hmm. ask. So many drones. I hope they won't recognize you, Polly. The tour booth is inside a small structure covered in six foot tall screens flashing MK ads to the world. The next group is just about ready to depart. Shit. Perfect timing. What? The guide. The guide's a drone. Oh, of course it is. Why pay someone when you can build a machine to do it for free? Standard operating procedure for them. Mark my words. Soon every job on the island will be done by these things. Problem is, they might know Jade. Too late now. I buy three tickets and we join the group. Two drone circles us hovering just above the ground and flies forward to open the first door. The thing introduced itself as. D. It's as annoying as its presence is grating. As part of its speech, it claims to be a true smart guy. Because guide. the previous guys are all idiots. And I was a tourist guide, so I feel personally attacked. The drone continues with its monologue, welcoming us to the beating heart of Athena, and groan reflexively. The whole group follows the drone and enters the tower. Uh, and I can't help but see us all as what we are. Lambs, gleefully walking into the slaughterhouse. Well, it is what it is. Okay, this leaves everything open. This will lock this one. I have to go this way. Wait, why is it locking up that one? I thought it didn't. Okay, but that gave me give me chaos and that. Managed to avoid being recognized. The drone thinks we're like any other tourist. This is so hard! <laughs> because I really don't have a clue, and on top of that, I, I don't know. Because, yes, it says unlocked by call for backup, but. And again, these, these two are dangerous, in my opinion. And yeah. I either want this one or this one, but I think I think we're going this way. Wait, this one is still locked. Oh, I can only do this. What? Conditions so I didn't go notice. Okay. Oh god, everything is a complicated now. The tour is excruciating, deadly boring. Why anyone would pay to hear drone list all the ways MK creates hand problems for fixing one is beyond me. I stopped listening after the first five minutes. Judging? <laughs> but how livid Nora and Jade look? The Funny less how they don't mention the downsides to the whole corpo takeover thing. Is it? Has it gotten that bad? Rents at a ten-year high. They replaced the old state police with a private security division. I mean, they privatized the hospitals and they own the medical insurance providers. Yeah, that sounds all too familiar. The whole thing's a scam. Nightmarish. Well, I'm going to die before we even find the damn entrance. I can feel my soul leaving my body. Pass the door, big, big, very definitely close. There's earth to each side, somehow missing, missed by diligent cleaning drums. Check marks, deep. 
That's gotta be it. That's our way in. And the drone? This is it. The moment when your faith is rewarded. A smile. The font couldn't be more correct. No. 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 I don't want power and I don't want to lose. No. a huge advertising panel to the ground. The screens are smashed, bleeding out pixels like a wounded oh, animal. Face. It's Jade. Her outburst is loud but calculated. Calm. Practice verse of the Look around activist. you, yeah? Look at what they've done to this place. But she's playing a part. I can see the cracks in the facade, the exhaustion beneath. Nora does too. She takes, she brought up, she takes up the protest. And our culture and turned this place into nothing but a carnival for tourists? Crowd is unmoved. They're on an MK2 after all. Still, a few faces are showing the first signs of curiosity. Is that the drone flying over Jade's beauty list of offenses the young woman has already committed? It's long. It's impressively long, actually. I wish I could congratulate Jade, but it's time for me to disappear. But I wanted to use the jammer. No, I don't want you to use my bomb. No! Why, why did this go so horrendously wrong? Why was this here, but none of this was an option for me? right now because I just played this do I have to play both because I honestly don't want to can I go back here no apparently not <sighs> but, but why why was I even shown this maybe in a replay different options maybe perhaps Uh, one more proof is not required. Yeah, and then I won't be able to go here because this one needs two bomb crystals. But no, then I'm gonna end in this one. And then I'm screwed up here. I think. But yeah, the conditions are have two bomb crystals and one truth. I do have a truth, but I don't have a bomb crystal. I've lost everything. Yeah, barriers understood. Branching understood. I want it on the volcanic plane. The other will be blocked forever. Well, okay. Just because it's locked. Yeah, I know. You need to reach the key that opens it. Secret key items. Okay, I didn't do that. Oh yeah, it might have been a consequence from like previously. Yeah, because 
this one needed to keep and everything else. I'm so tempted to restart the chapter. But nothing, because this was linear, there's nothing I could have changed here. I don't remember if this had anything. Okay, I will restart it because I definitely want to see that um, again. I want to see the map again. I can take my way through it or something. Hey, thought we so first. Where she? Well, second, which is. But where to start? Well, you look. I already. Okay, it we we will the close. All right then, let's hear your. Okay, because I can listen to. But oh, well, this was the truth crystal. Yeah, I have what people. That's very. It's too wait, I don't know. There are no none. Hard to I will we I can get He's right. What's in we have a you will and we got that look at us and she's my mere for Okay, is that we need the other bond? Tell me no no tell her. Okay done it must be what the foundation even the plan. No what? no I have to. when did all the and uh a drop it's about Okay Okay, because these were these were keys. Yeah, that was a key to that one. This is Okay, we're back to the tutorial. What did, what did that mean? Uh, is it in this one? It is a consequence of outcomes. Choosing an outcome at the end of an act. Okay, so that one is completely blocked anyway. Which I had I wasn't aware of. Yeah, because it's like it shows that there, there would be he might be orange. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe Thancred? Wouldn't it be closer to Thancred? And it sounds a bit more like Thancred. Um because he kind of looks like the voice actor. Um Yeah, the problem is this only gives me true. That is the call for backup. Right, okay. So if you go this path. The energy between them lights up. Okay, J. Janora, the energy between them lights up the whole bar because I think I only chose Jammer before. Wobbly stools, edge tables, pictures of Atina and his people over the last four decades. For a moment I feel desperately I could call some friends and ask them to create a diversion. Ah, a classic. That's what I want. Use that one a bunch of times. Nine times out of ten works like a charm. And the one time it doesn't? I think you can still see the scar. Look. <laughs> With enough people outside, we can keep security busy while we sneak in and save Ursula. Or you might attract every renter cop in the place, trapping you inside. Lots of unknowns. Agreed. Stirring up trouble isn't the way forward. Polly? I need a second. So much as I agree with Omar and Laszlo. It's risky. Oh, come on. But a bad plan with good timing might just be what we need. Mm, MK will never see us coming. They'll be occupied. A bad idea with no safety net. It's all or nothing. Nothing means. Well, that's it. You're gonna have a lot of people to arrest, though, and maybe there is another way out. I'm not saying no. At this point, we can't afford to reject any options. And I trust Jade and Nora. At least mm. someone does. Light and hope. That's what they are. Okay, so this should give me the path that I need. And I still have to let's get rid of things first. I want to question them directly. How did I not do these before? I can't just leave this to chance. My doubts need airing. True, I don't know Omar that well, but I'm sure he listened to me and maybe. If me everything you've told us is true, and if your relationship with my mother is what you say it is, then sure. I'm inclined to trust you. That's a run up to a but. But he smiles. There's I appreciate there. the honesty. But you straight up saying we're the weak link in a chain of trust here? Out. I really gestured to less All right, stay then. out of this. Hit me. What do you want to know? That I haven't told you already. Let's start with what you were researching. With Ursula. What's so secret about it? Ah. The direct hit. The one question I can't answer. 
Oh, I've told you as much as I can. As for the rest, well, I need Ursula's consent. Okay, he's a, he's a And if the rest was valuable information, that'd save us all a lot of trouble. Consent's consent. What can I say? Loyalty's important to me. Sorry. Nora and Jade are watching from the farm table like we're actors in a telenovela. I've got to admit, since I met Omar, not once have I felt that his words or tone were anything but genuine. He's a straight shooter if I ever saw one. But is that enough to trust someone with my future? With my life and the life of my mother? Okay. That'll have to do, I guess. Hope you know why I had to ask. I do. Of course. So it all comes down to blind trust, but what choice do I have? Okay, so this is much better than it was before, in my opinion, at least. Uh, from no, from some table. Let's go. Okay, yeah, we've done this one. Yeah, and a choice segment where everybody's yelling in our ear. Up there. Keep it a true. Do not. I want we have a backup. Not there's no then how Polly and the jammer. Hey, stress like a fine. This is up to you. I do see the importance in like trusting Omer and giving him a chance to prove himself. But yeah, but Jay, kind of I know it. I'm responsible. If okay, okay, so we're dealing with the girls. Sorry, usually I wouldn't do this. It's all time. We're talking. Big summer. Energy. Oh, oh, guy. Oh. Standard. And not look with the icons. Okay, we have to do with that anyway. No. Oh no, this is the one I unlocked. Okay. No, wait. I have to. I have to go this way. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I should be able to get the one that I'm going to I mean, they've all the I'm going I can feel That's got And the drip is it Okay Now Yes, this is possible See, because I don't want Our I should have quick glance at Jade Something tells me she was expecting oh, this The phone appears in her hand She presses three times, increasing sharply A moment passes while Piggity asks us to admire a piece of art created by AI Hmm <laughs> Suddenly, the street falls ominously silent. A man in front of us turns. His face is masked with black and white marks resembling a face, but hiding his real features. A friend of Jade's here all Let's along. Let's fucking have it, then. Another masked figure turns toward the drone. Then another. There are ten, twenty around us. All at once, their phones start to blare the same song in unison. Their uncanny mask smiles sardonically at the drone. Piggy flies from one face to the other, his camera desperate to capture and understand what's happening. The situation isn't in his programming. The ID scan pings negative over and over. With a harsher turn than before, its little voice demands confirmation that the activists have legal rights to this song. <laughs> Why aren't the girls back? That's so cute. But our people, rather. As we run to the door, I feel myself passing through lines of energy. Not from MK. This nut is like a warm blanket of emotions. Bond is there, among the masked silhouettes, arms wide open, invisible to Run, Harmony. Me. Run to your mother. Is that some confirmation that we're on the right track? Okay, thank you. This is exactly what I wanted. Yes, we got my part. The door swings open. The sand squeals under the moving metal, grating in our ears. We run into the corridor, empty apart from some digging tools. MK hasn't branded this place that yet. That was close. Can't stop now. We need to... A crash against the door. It slams open. It's oh, PD. Bloody thing. Bugger off! The three of us jump at the door and shove it hard against the machine. There's a powerful reactor screaming beneath its belly, but it can't fight us. Unauthorized entry, the zone is of limits, we ignore its bleating. Suddenly there's no more resistance, the door slams shut on our weight. It's as if the drone just vanished. The sh shitty thing is it knows now that somebody's gone in there. A silence and then we hear gurgling noises Someone coming from the took it down. Whoever's doing that deserves a medal. Come on, let's go. Grab up a nearby shovel and slide it through that the door. That should do handle. it. For now. Maybe. Yeah, I will take a while to break that. My talent for inspiration of speeches remains Let's unmatched. book it. Jade and Norris sprint for the corridor. I take a second to catch my breath first. Okay. And now for the inevitable one. 
stairs, lots of stairs. To walk back up will be an ordeal, but we'll deal with that later if we make it out at all. So do you think that putting some power into bomb this way? How deep does this go? Jade's voice echoes through the staircase. Every reverberation more Should sinister than the last. Clothes. She's right. The railing is wet and frigid under my hand. The temperature has dropped so much that this is actually kind of where I worked as a tourist guide because I worked in the ground fortifications. And yeah, temperatures different. Moisture levels are very Feels different. Feels like we're exploring a tomb in an adventure movie. Mm -hmm. That's exactly it. Except we're not about to find a treasure at the end. My mother but doesn't count. No spiders, please. Great. Oh, there were so many. More flights of stairs, but eventually we arrive at the door. It has a glass panel that allows us to peek off a peek of what's ahead. And what's ahead is shit. Through the glass I see Yana leaning against the wall waiting for us. Oh, Me. They don't like you, Paul. I mean, yeah. If looks could kill and all that. It's alright. They um maybe it's better if Oh man, but tension. Come on, we're going back up. What? We're making sure nobody's following us. Come on. <laughs> and that's it. Now it's just me, hand on the door, a few steps from Yana. Shit. Only one way to find out. Well, I guess maybe we can fix the damages we've done before. Why are they here? Why now? Whoa. Life is strange. Oh, you had to plant that in there. Sometimes that just hits me. Here I am, infiltrating an MK building to begin my search for an ancient missing temple. Abruptly I stop, I'm not under the tower anymore, I'm somewhere else. I swear, if chaos is in our you know. Every somewhere in Bond's mangrove forest, I was gonna say that's this. She's nowhere to be found. Behind the trees, through the leaves, I can feel Yana's presence. Yana's very close, they wait for me in the real world. Yana and the keen eyes, the sharp aura, their ways I apparently haven't forgotten. Yana, the walking reminder of how much I missed out when I left Cantina. Are you quite well? No. I am. My mind was drifting and. He raises his head. He felt Yana, my thoughts of Yana, like a sunny boom above us. This our one. Heads. They are important to you? They. could be. I haven't seen them in. So long. Forgotten feelings. Is it a warning? An omen? Before I can reply, I'm pulled back to Britain to face the inevitable. The ruins. My mother can't hey. be far. Hey. There's a gate in front of us leading to the next room of the ruins. I'm stuck in a room with Yama. Please tell me there's an like apology option. Okay, they're all lead over there regardless. Avoid them. Talk to them. No, we're talking. Oh, no. Mm -mm. We were given this opportunity to talk. No way around it. I have to talk to Yana here now. I don't know why you're here, but I wish... I wish we were somewhere else. Under very different circumstances. My life was on a very different path before my mother disappeared, and since then, everything's been a whirlwind. Emotions all over the place. Which is interesting, again, because she did study neurology. What am I saying? Should There's I be a lot to talk this? about, but it's not the right time for either of us. Do I end with a smile? Should I just turn around and hope they don't have anything to say? A couple of seconds pass and then Yana sighs. A deep sigh, their face full of complex emotions. I can't choose that, no? Oh, I didn't try to fool them. Okay, so this is the only option we have. A sigh fills the room for a moment. I feel like I've it's been all expecting over. you. I mean, obviously. She looks. They look pissed. Look, there's a lot to say. I know that. But I don't... Polly, you dropped this. They extend their arm a key You better card. run. I don't know how long this place will stay empty. Thank you. I dropped the key. on you next time. They smile. Go. And I smile back. Run. I nod, slide the key card into the reader and Can rush through the it? door. Links forged through common ground across varied perspectives. 
Okay, so I didn't do that badly in the last act. Thankfully. There's nothing quite like it. Not in any world. We barely spoke. You are honest and frank once again. Such links are formed through faith repeated, no matter our differences. Tell Good. To turn around. I'm glad. I'm afraid it will slow me down. I want to go though. Why is it? Mm. Okay, at least this one is. <sighs> at least this one is chaos, and not power. I think that is the only choice I have. Damn it! And here I was really hungo, hoping for bond. These ruins seem like an anthill, all tunnels designed to be bustling. That's the best comparison I can think of. An anthill without ants. All of a sudden I stumble upon a guard. He's lying face down on the ground. Someone knocked Ooh, him out cold. You should see the dreams that one's having. Vivid. You're doing? Maybe, maybe not. Hmm. Inscrutability is the key to my charm, you know. I keep walking, but now my fists are clenched, all my senses on high alert. And then, I see the center of the ruins of I do think it's important because this was a Deus Ex Machina. It takes me a second to understand what I'm looking at. A strange cave lit from an unknown source, a discounted MK security vest tag and all. And my mother in the arms Let's of. Hope. It takes me a second to understand what I'm looking at. She isn't waking up, Polly. What did you? I. I'm sorry, but uh, I thought I could solve this without any of you getting hurt. Braxes fell on me and I rushed to them. I checked Ursula, faint heartbeat, quiet breathing. Did you find sleep. her like this? I did. I... I... I infiltrated the building on my own. Had to force my way in, but... I don't know if I'm buying that. I put my hand to Ursula's face. Oh, wait. Cold. Look! Her eyelids battle for a second against sleep. They flutter open and my mother looks around with empty eyes. She stands up hey. shakily. Hey there, I'm fine. I just need a second. Take a step back. Somewhere above our heads, an alarm blares. It seems like someone oh, with the ants. Look at them. How touching. How the fuck did he get in? We needed to Young keep love. Going. Isn't it sweet? Not if MK catches us. Oh, I don't know. Your man here is a fighter. Lovely obliques. Wouldn't mm -hmm. that be a sight to see? I know you're behind this. And sooner or later, I'll find out why. I don't have time for this. I'll snap my fingers Lazlo, sharply. We need to go. Can you... Carry her. Yes, of course. Lazlo scoops Ursula up and she huddles in his arms. We slip away from the ruins through a dimly lit passage. Behind us, footsteps resonate in the complex like metallic drums, sounding a prelude to war. <coughs> okay. That would have ended very differently. Okay, this is the only reveal of our truth. We can't do any of the others. I might call it after this one because I mean it's been quite long. Well, and doing it in two hour increments doesn't doesn't seem long. We did it. We leave through the same rooms and the same corridors. This time, though, they feel void of danger. Again, how the fuck did he get in unless he has his own keycard? I'm not trusting him. It's not until we're near the Nayads that I dared to look we at my mother. have a lot of explaining to do. Being lectured by my own daughter. Truly. How delightful. Don't start with the sarcasm. After everything we just did, you have no right- A fair point. Although I must say, I didn't ask for your assistance. What were you doing? Where were you? Why didn't you leave a note or a letter or something? I... I don't have the answers you're looking for. Okay, the voice is cool as well. Wouldn't be the How can that possibly be true? I need time. It has been a frightfully stressful day and I want to... I need 
to sleep some things off. Please, darling. I'm tired. Let's go inside. She not lying about that, at least. Again, yeah, there's a typo. Um, she looks terrible, her eyes drifting lazily out of focus now and again. We don't know when she's going to wake up next. Without another word, we set off towards her. There, the atmosphere is morose, to say the least. I take the first opportunity to hightail it out of our little reunion. By the time I'm alone again, I feel the tug of reverie. There's no point resisting as much as I'd like to. Oh, God. I can read count. Unfortunately, it's a bit small, this one. But thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. Um, you're coming in towards the end of uh, chapter, act. I think this is the end of act three. I think, yeah. It's the end of act three. Um, scene? Scene three? I'm, I'm, I'm losing count here. <laughs> Within moments, the familiar feeling takes me and I open my eyes so, to see truth before me. You found your mother at last. Impressive. I'm sure you are simply thrilled to have her back. Of course I am. I mean, she was never the easiest person to get on with, but I'm glad for Laszlo and Nora. The stress was killing them. Yes, she's not thinking of them. The uh, time has me. come to track down our missing siblings. We will need them <gasps> to pry Glory from her little stronghold. Oh, that's the other one. She's Glory? Kids. Oh my god. And I'm sure the others have lingering questions as well on the subject of my shattering. Yeah, that too. Definitely, definitely that too. So I wonder if the heart has been strengthened or weakened in the meantime. Um, this is, of course, this is what it is. Each pillar represents one of the aspirations. We move further into reverie, joining the other aspirations. There's a tremor of this in? No, a tremor of a With the egregor the you found, you are ready to enter Chaos's maze. Wait, we found Be some? brave. You will face many truths amongst those pathways. Some exceedingly unpleasant. I'm speaking before I've even fully noticed I'm my ready. attention. I am. I am ready. Ooh. Yeah. That's definitely... So this is glory. Oh, I would have known they were at. I definitely want more crystals for bond. Um, let's have a tiny bit ahead of chaos. We have truth behind. Again, I don't trust power. And I don't know if I'm going to trust glory as much. But ideally, I would want to try and get um, balance between them. Oh, we get a mini trailer again. Yes. This is perfect because this is where we're going to end. Say that was her. So she was a lot of chaos because I had an inkling about that. That makes so much sense. Oh my god. Oh yeah, because maybe was this? Yeah, oh no, this was only act two. Um, Lost back home, which is different. Major change is coming to Atlan Reverie, and I have no choice but to be a part of it. Ooh. Yeah, no, I'm definitely, I'm definitely continuing to tomorrow. Um, I do love this. Nope, nope. Return to main menu. Yes, I will just have to do the last uh, thing, thing about the game. Oh my god, what a delightful game! As I said, don't know has an amazing. Again, I don't know if they were heavily involved in the creation. I would need to read up on that. I'm going to try to do my homework for tomorrow. Um, such a delightful game. Um, oh, I love games like these. Um, I have several that are a bit in, in, in the vein of this art style. Um, yeah, so, so more of this tomorrow. Um, and I will, I will put the end screen on with the rest of this, because if I put my normal music on, it would just break the atmosphere. So I shall see you tomorrow.
and enjoy and have a good night. Bye.